possession up for grabs. Capella, little flick round the corner on the near side, and then he tries to launch it forward. Monteverdi thought about coming in and then thought twice, and that's a wonderful pass. Look at that from Del Tor up to the young Argentine at the front door. Super skills, and Monteverdi comes flying back, but he can't stop. Begadi coming through and getting the score for Abu Dhabi. Wonderful pass, wasn't it? And, well, he put it on a plate, and despite the attentions of young Luqui Monteverdi, Picked up by Panelo. He's been tagged and hooked out of it there by Gonzalo Del Tor. Del Tor comes around the corner. Oh, good skills out of the air. And then once again, plucking it there and keeping possession. But look at this from Tomas Panelo. Lovely skills from him as he nicks the ball away and controls things here and tries to set up an attack here. Offloads there towards Monteverdi. Capella is there. Oh, he decided to go near side and he left it very late. And in the end, the ball was underneath the horse. and Lukin has pulled the trigger that one looks like it's leaking left no it's not it's inside the post wonderful stuff from Lukin Monteverdi from range and wow he's cut the gap UAE trailing by just one it's four goals to three great stuff from the 15 year old he had that chance at the scoreboard end and got a terrible bounce but he looks confident middling the ball as Capella comes flying through on the grey. Tammy Willington will have to come back in defence here. But he scored. Wow, look at that. Miles out. He's absolutely smashed it. And he's perfect with the radar. And well, they're exchanging long-range goals here on field number three at the Al Habtour Polar Resort and Club in the IFSA Gold Cup 2021. Superb stuff as we see it on the replay. He'd absolutely crunched it. And... Uh, very, very accurate from range. It's five goals to three. Abu Dhabi wrestling back that two-goal advantage. Back is the call. And back is the call. Superb play there from uh, Painelo. But there's no one on the end of it. Although Monteverdi's stolen it away now after a little mistake there from Del Tor. Still Luquin. In possession of the ball here, the youngster for UAE. Well, he's been... Pushed out of the way. Willington comes in on the head-to-head -head and nicks it back. Clever work there from Tammy Willington. Once again, in a good position and well-read from him. Oh, look at this. Monteverdi's gone through the pack. Monteverdi, surely from there, is going to get the score. Well, it's raining goals here in the second chucker. And it's 5-4. Demi Willington, couple of taps, and then goes high. Good contact on the ball, but uh, it's out to the left, and Monteverdi's been pushed out of the way. Capella comes in and reverses it with a tail backhander. Del Tor flying through both sides of the pony. Oh, great skills there from Panello as he put the brakes on. He kept possession of the ball. He's got Willington going beyond. Can Willington get beyond his man? He's absolutely flying down towards goal. He switches to the near side. Superb little backhander coming in and getting the ball away from the danger zone. But Panello, oh, look at the skills round the corner again from Tomas Panello. That is absolutely sensational stuff. Brilliant bit of riding and skill from Panello. And he's got the score and he's tied the match at five. Well, we see the replay here. He's great at just putting the brakes on and leaning back in the back of the saddle, stick out the back, waiting for the ball to catch up with him. Four minutes and 15 seconds remaining. Clash of sticks there as Monteverdi comes around the corner and uh, retains possession, gets away from some of these UAE players. He's got back up. Here comes Panello, who seems to be pretty hot at the moment. He's coming out to the left-hand side, and we've got a, a problem there with a the horse, I'm afraid. And there will be a break in play. Effectively, it will be uncontested. 
And that's good sportsmanship. Good to see. And the ball has been tapped across the line by UAE. Well, there's an immediate whistle from the restart. As young Bautista Begari came flying around the corner. He thought he had possession of the ball. Panella was there for a piece of the action. As was Her Highness Sheikha Mehta. Loud blast from the umpires. Temi Willington's got plenty on that. He's absolutely smashed it up to the front. Oh, unlucky there for Panello. It's come off the, the bum of the pony there of his uh, opponent and fallen very nicely here for Abu Dhabi and breaking away with the ball on the far side there is Capella, hooked eventually by Panello. Willington comes in. That's an important play there from Temi Willington. Superb stuff. Look at that. Got the hook, spun around the corner and then smashes it forward. And he's put the pass right up in front of Monteverdi. Monteverdi down in front of goal. Lukin Monteverdi for another one for UAE. Well, what a play there from Temi Willington on the boards. Reaching out, got the hook. As he hooked the stick, flew around the corner. Saw that Monteverdi had gone beyond the last man. And he smashes that under the next shot. Lands straight in front of the young Argentine. And he does the damage and gets the ball over the line. And with less than a minute remaining here until the first hooter before half time, UAE back in the lead, back in the lead, seven six. Del Tor. Faris flying down the field, taken out of it by Sheikha Mehta. Superb work from her. Backed up by Panello. Monteverdi's there for a piece of the action. As is Capella, chopping it back towards goal. And there's a chance here for Abu Dhabi. Surely from there they're going to get the score, and they do. Monteverdi came flying through in defence, but uh, it was too little too late. And well, as we go into half-time, it looks like we're going to have a tied game here, folks. That hit, I think that hit Shaker Mehta. But anyway, Willington's back in possession of the ball and the attack will continue here with Temi Willington trying to work this one up over the halfway line. Offloads and gets plenty on it. It's coming down from a great height. Farris is there. He's trying to muscle it away from the danger zone. It's straight to Monteverdi. Monteverdi goes under his pony's neck but didn't get the contact that he wanted. And there's a chance here for Abu Dhabi on the breakaway if they can offload this to the front door. Superb stuff. And look at the overlap. They're completely and utterly outnumbered here in defence. Here comes Farris. Good first shot from him. Glances over the shoulder. Steadies the pony. Shaker Mathers absolutely bombing back in defence. But the shots come in from Farris. Where's it gone? Farris. He's got the score. What a goal from Farris. Al Yavuni, wonderful stuff. And the approach shot was perfect, wasn't it? This one's fallen nicely for Del Tor. Begari is there. He gets away from Panelo. Muscles it forward, goes past his teammate. Sheikha Mehta's there with some superb work on the near side, but she's not going to get there. And look at this, begari has gone the whole way. Or has he? No, it's been chipped away right on the goal line. And some good work there from Luquim Monteverdi. Panello joins the party. Monteverdi flicks it forward. Open backhander comes back into the mix. That looks pretty good as he got the score. Oh, what a goal that is. Superb near side backhand goal from Bautista Begadi just to rub salt into the UAE wounds. And he's got another one with just 35 seconds left on the clock here in the fifth. And the difference is four. It's 12 goals to eight. That is the end of the fifth and final chakra. Our last chakra of the day here in the IFSA Gold Cup 2021.